Today I'm going to choose a random starting location and let a random wheel decide absolutely everything about my character. So I can either get really lucky or incredibly unlucky. So of course the first thing we need to do is work out what date we're going to be starting in. So I got this wheel here and then we'll just spin it and see what we get. And then at the end, if we go on this, we can see all our results from every single one. So we'll just spin and then we'll go in and pick our start date. So 1066 it is. Okay, so we're in 1066, and we're going to do random character and see who we get. Oh, okay, that, that's actually quite an interesting start. Don't know how good it's going to be. This may be pretty challenging, but you know what? We'll see how it goes. And then back over on the random input wheel, we're going to open our lists. And then, of course, do gender, and we'll just see what we get, male or female. Female, so we're already a female, so we'll just leave it like that. And then we'll get started off. We'll do the first thing that you see on here. So education traits and spin. Let's see what we get. Stewardship 4. You know what? That's brilliant. So education and stewardship 4. So that's Midas touched, of course. So I've done them all the same way. I just numbered them rather than write out each one. Okay, so yeah, we don't need to mess around with that. Next, personality. So we got our personality wheel here. Let's see. We've got to spin it three times ambitious you know what that's amazing let's see shy okay that's not too great and finally we have calm okay not the worst it'll do shy is one i really dislike it does cause so many issues so yeah you just you get so much stress with this kind of character and of course last was calm which is this so that's gonna give us more diplomacy and intrigue and help with our stress loss which i just said will probably be an issue so that is kind of helpful and finally we of course and this is the one which causes so many problems so yeah finally we need other traits we're gonna give ourselves two and these this is the really awkward one because, yeah, there's a bunch of, you know, decent ones, like Hunter. And then you got One-Eyed, Blind, <laughs> all the problem ones, like Cancer, Pneumonia, and stuff like that. So we're going to get two. And hopefully they're not just deadly. One-legged, right, okay. Come on, don't be something too bad, please. You know what? I've done a few test runs on this, and that's probably the best I've had. So, yeah, as you can see, these are all the roles we've done. One-legged. Right, let's go and do that now. We need to, you know, remove one of our legs. And where is it? There we are. So that is going to help with our fertility. So we might get a bunch of kids, which, all in all, will be quite good. Although, <sighs> this may be the issue. So, of course, now i got to decide the age. And I just please be below 40. Three? <laughs> Shit. It's a bit young, but we'll manage, hopefully. But let's see how this is. We've got to be three years old. Great. Age all the way down to three. So now we have a one-legged three-year-old. Right. Oh, and we've lost the education trait. Obviously, we're too young. That sucks. That was like the best thing about this character. Let's see what name we're going to have then. Dazin? That's a pretty cool name. I'm probably butchering the pronunciation, but uh, we're ready. Let's go. I haven't touched any of them either. We're just going to leave that and we're going to get straight in, of course, on the 1066 start date. Now we just kind of got to scout out our situation. Our liege is quite young as well, and he is not married. I don't want to do that though, because then I'm not going to have kids of my own. So yeah, that's a bad idea because he's never going to accept a matrilineal marriage. Alliance power may straight up be the way because we're going to want to expand. And let's see, that guy's independent, he's got a decent amount of troops. Let's see, yeah, you know what, let's go with him. And how old is he? Four? That's brilliant. So let's go ahead and do that straight away, before he gets married to somebody else. We are tribal, so you know what, shall we try a marshal maybe? You know what, I'm going to choose a marshal. Oh, okay, so he's not the main liege then, he's just my liege. So yeah, we can pro we're probably going to want to take his land. He has no alliances, which is great. I think that's the plan. How strong... Like, how many troops do we have, though? 200. Because this guy only has 500. So, you know what? If we maybe get a Cassius Belli and go for him, that may be the best way to do this. So, let's start getting a Cassius Belli on his land. And then after we get him, hopefully, we'll be strong enough to take our liege out. One thing I forgot, I should probably make someone educate me. Now, I'm just going to go full crazy marshal. So maybe this guy is going to be the best. 
Yeah, we'll go with him. See if he'll educate us. And, okay, we got our claim. So we're going to go in debt. As soon as we get out of debt, let's see. We may be able to beat him, especially with our alliance. Hopefully, they don't go to any wars. I swear this game listens to what I says and it just does what I don't want to happen. I literally just said, as long as he doesn't go to war. And, of course, a war starts. We'll accept. Let's see. What is the troop numbers? Yeah, they should win that. I'll keep an eye on it if they need me. But, yeah, they should win that. Um, or not. I'm just not going to get involved. Let me check. If we go on faith, I'm just, I'll, I'll just leave them to it. A lot of people have just joined. Hopefully he doesn't lose too many troops because that would really suck. Oh, he's calling us to another war. What is going on? Peasant uprising. Oh, we might actually go and help him for that one. We'll see if we can defeat these. What? Why? Oh, we got to go all the way around. This is such a pain. I thought I could walk this way because it was coloured in, but nope. Yeah, the land over here is quite awkward. Yeah, my troops are coming. Chill out, mate. Chill, chill, chill. Oh, no. They've just grouped together. This is hopeless. Let's see. Hopefully, they don't chase us, which they... Okay, right. Okay, that army just got obliterated. There's nothing I can do. You lost. So, yeah. Hopefully, my one county doesn't get attacked. Thing is, we can't make any more allies either. Cause it's not like we have any children, obviously. Although, got a couple of years left on that. Ooh, so I can get a pet cat. Of course I'm going to do that. And we'll name her Paws. Ah, oh, they're sieging my one county. It's not like I can do anything against 2,600 troops. And my liege has gone to war. This is getting a bit hectic. Oh, we have such a terrible alliance now. I mean, we can just break the betrothal. Say bye. And then let's get alliance power. Let's see what we can get this time. 800 there. There's no great alliances going, let's be honest, but we'll try this. And you know what? We've got a lot of prestige. Let's make some men at arms. I'm thinking some of these, are they much better than armored footmen? By a fair amount, yeah. We'll get one of them on the go. Let's go for it. And we're going to call our ally straight away because I don't think we can do it without him. Perfect. Right, let's raise our troops and hold out here. Can we beat these? It's quite even. So let's see if we can hold out maybe and get... Some sort of defender advantage. Our ally is making his way across. Let's see. Who is leading our army? He's got good siege time. So actually, yeah, we'll stick with that. Oh, wait. What is this? The old ways have served us well, and we will always honor them. However, as the Walia of Tuat, um, I swear, YouTube, I'm not actually swearing. Can't demonetize this. That's literally not a swear word. I have concluded that we must adopt feudalism. Oh, okay. Really? You f... Nice, we jumped in the same time. So now I'm going negative because of our men at arms that I did purchase with prestige. Which kind of sucks. I wish I bought more now because I could have used prestige for them instead. Yeah, that really sucks how we changed the food all actually. But we won that. Perfect. Nice, now we've like doubled our land. And our liege only has him down there. And this guy. So yeah, they're quite far away. But we will probably need to go for them before our liege, maybe. Oh, okay. I just realized both his other vassals are just counts. So, yeah, we'll just make a claim on his capital then to see if we can get that. How powerful is he? Only 600. So, how much is it to upgrade one of these now? 108. Yeah, that's quite expensive. Okay, we've come of age. Brilliant strategist. You know what? That's pretty good. So, let's actually go into a marshal then. We're going to get... Yeah, we'll get the plus three. Let's see, we're going to become an absolute savage. The one-legged savage. Uh, he's going to offer me the position of spy master. So yeah, of course, I'll accept that. Why not? So that is going to grant us more natural dread. Better scheme chances and stuff like that. Although we do kind of want to become his marshal. So let's actually modify contract. I can't seem to. Oh, he's a clan. Oh, we're clan, not fi... Oh, okay. Okay, so of course we're clan, not actually feudal government. I'm his spy master, and I have a pretty good chance to kill him, making him even weaker. So I might actually do that. Start a scheme to kill him. And then if we can get, you know, his kid to take over. This is going to take four years, though. Is there anyone we can invite? Uh, how much? 75. That's quite expensive. Oh, you know what? Let's get one person to join. See it done. Let's go. We're still not in debt either. So let's hold out seven more months. Okay, nice. So I got a perk. I'm going to get Casa Spell I cost down first. Because, yeah, we're going to need to declare war. So we might as well make it half the price. 
It's only for half his land, but we're going to smash him. So you know what? We may as well get this guy to just finish making a claim down here as well. Let's get rid of him. Okay, so what is this then? The power of words. So we can pay 15 gold and everyone kind of hates him. Murder scheme gains progress. Yeah, let's just pay the 15 gold. And come on. Um, he's still alive. Oh, okay. Nice. He's dead. Right. And now how much weaker are they? Not much weaker, actually. He's still got 500 troops, but let's go. Our claims. We have 800 troops. Okay, we might not even need our ally then. That's my bad. I only thought we had like 300. So let's get in. Come on. Yeah, easy, guys. And let's siege this. Our allies are probably going to go and fight them if they stay around this area. Hopefully they go and fight them. Uh, no, they're going to come down here. Oh, they're smaller than 400. They can't actually go and siege it. Okay, well, <laughs> leave them to it then. That's a bit weird how they've done that. And uh, it looks like they're going to go up and fight them anyway. Yeah, so we'll siege that. They do that. Easy, easy. Nice. 100%. Actually, how, how much is this siege? Oh, we'll let them siege this. How much gold is here? 17. We might as well take the 17 gold. Yeah, there we are. And now we'll end it. Problem is, yeah, we're going to have a truce with this guy. Okay, we don't have such a good chance. So I imagine we're not on his court. Oh, okay, he's put me on his court as the steward. Okay, I kind of like this guy now. You know, maybe we don't take the last bit of land. You know, that's pretty good. Wait, this guy thinks he can arrest me. Uh, no. Oh, now we got to fight him again, really? Not see what just happened. Like, good choice. Great life choices there. And he's just going to run around the entire desert. And you're trying to blackmail me. Wait, what is going on? Chill. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're going to accept that. Because, yeah, he knows we killed our liege. Hopefully the siege ends it. There we are. And another 17 gold. Ooh, okay. So somebody else has now taken over because that was a tyranny war. So we can actually declare war without a penalty for having a truce. These guys are making it too easy for me. And we'll try and hold the siege on their capital. If they go the other way, that's actually decent for us. Because if we siege his capital, it might just end. Which I think it will, because that's all the land he has left. Okay, so yeah, we didn't need to call our ally, but it's fine. Okay, so now we're actually a vassal of the main liege. And he's not that powerful either. Why does this kid hate us? Wait. Why is that his primary heir? Are they... Oh. Okay, so... Yeah, the guy we murdered was his brother. And we've been taking all his family's land. Didn't realize that one. That's a bit awkward. It's time. Let's get some camel riders on the go. Let's go. Get these up a fair amount. And... Yeah, we do kind of want to get on his court. Although I don't know if he's going to let us be on his court. Wait. Oh, okay. Our lead's just changed. Right. <laughs> non-stop playing in africa is pretty mad and yeah this kingdom's going a bit mad they're getting into the bottom of spain oh, 1300 troops this is a tyranny war i mean i don't like you so i don't know why you're calling me to the war i will not be helping you but now you know we have got to think what our next move is going to be because yeah we need to make some claims this guy's terrible why have we got him you know what? I think we can take him. Let's get a claim going in his capital. Oh, he's finally come of age. What did he get? Pissed. Okay, he got drunk. Great. Uh, we're going to get him on managed domains. Why not? Get some extra gold to make some more camel riders. He wants to make me the steward as well. That's amazing. Hopefully, he's going to win this then. We can stay as his steward. Oh, this guy is tragic. He needs to die. Can we murder him? He has a strong hook. Why does that stop me murdering? Oh, it's this guy, we need him gone, like actually gone. We're kind of stuck with him and he's terrible. Oh, okay. We can actually declare war on this guy. We can conquer county and get all his land. Yeah, let's do that. So, because yeah, that guy's taken so long to make a claim. We can't kill him, which is just terrible. We should win this. This should not be a problem for us. Let's get it. Yeah, as soon as this is over, the war should end. Nice. So we now have four counties, I believe. And we got a fair amount of money. So I'm going to get some more camel riders. Um, I'll make two more lots of them. Quite expensive, but it's going to be so helpful. Ooh, finally we are pregnant. So let's see what we get. Said that like it's some sort of Pokemon like. But you know what I mean. I don't get why we can't murder him though. Because he has a strong hook. Like surely that's a reason to murder someone. Don't really make any sense to me. Okay, we got a daughter. Uh, we'll get you in a diplomacy. Why not? And we'll try and make a good alliance. 
because this is not going to be a super long, like, you know, game. I don't mind just marrying for alliances where I can. Gonna marry... Do you have, how many kids do you have? Loads. So if we marry you to him, you could theoretically murder this guy and he would be next. So let's do that. You're not going to take a matrilineal. That's fine. We'll have more children. Let's just do that. It's a great alliance for us. We can get this guy to join our court. He has 27 learning. So if he joins... Oh, we need to find some way to get rid of him. Can we just, like, expose... I can't get rid of the secret. Can I expose the secret I have? Or is it just the other way around? See? There's no secrets to select. Because I would generally just expose the murderer thing to have this guy on my court. He'd make claims in, like, a day rather than four years. Oh, no. Cat died. Rip. 117 for the claim. So, yeah, we're in, like, mega debt. Okay, so we're gonna have to hold out, get out of debt, and then we can go to war for our claims. Oh, because this is the wrong holding type. How much is it to... Oh, we need 170 to actually make this place useful at all, or we can just grant it to somebody. Uh, so what we're gonna do, we'll just grant this to somebody, and they can be their problem. Wait, if we grant it to this guy, will he get off? Uh, let's all make him somebody else's... Vassal, though. Oh. Okay, we, we can finally go to war. And you know what? I think we can do it. Let's just go for it. Declare war. Let's go. Okay, he's got some enemy allies joining, but if we can get in there quickly and maybe siege out the land, maybe we'll automatically win with a bit of luck. Nice, finally, we are pregnant again, so let's hope we get a son this time. Nice. Didn't even give his allies a chance to even step in. Do I want to go and help out in this? Not really, to be honest. But, oh yeah, we got no chance against them. Let's just disband. Yeah, is there a title I can make? Okay, ransom someone for 25 gold. I'll do that. Titles can be created. Okay, so we need 250 gold. So yeah, we can stop being a count and we can actually have some vassals. Okay, and I completely forgot. How old is this guy now? 44. He better not outlive me. I'm 31. Okay, he should die before me. Next up, should we go for... Go for this guy. He seems quite weak. Yeah, we'll finish this guy's land off. We just desperately need the prestige now. Yes! Oh, wait, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. That was amazing. Oh, I was so excited. I thought it was this guy. Oh, he's actually so frustrating. Is there a... Oh, we need 20 learning. Okay, we're not going to get 20 learning. Is there like a way to get rid of him? Am I being stupid? If you know, please let me know in the comments. Because I'd, I'd love to know. Because he has ruined this run so far. So yeah, plan of action is become a duke. Get the rest of draw. Okay, and we can get strategist. So yeah, more diplomacy plus three martial. Great. Okay, what does it say? We can gain prestige. Uh, gain prestige and the nickname The Hawk. That is a pretty... Ooh, the Unrelenting. Ooh, so... Mm, that's quite tough. The Unrelenting. It's just a bit scarier, isn't it? You know? If someone has the nickname The Hawk, I think they have, like, a really big nose. Not that scary, is it? And um, we'll go with Twat. Twat. I mean, uh, yeah, that place. Okay, so we're finally a duke. And that means we can give this away to somebody. Now, if we give this guy a thing. Will he stop? I think... Right, it will st... Is it maybe when you're feudal? I, I think it might just be when you're feudal then. That you're like bishop or the mufti. Cannot be a vassal, but I think that is when you're full-on feudal. Not clan, and I don't have tons of experience while being clan. So yeah, I, that that's a mistake. And this guy's gonna annoy me even more now. So yeah, we'll serve, we'll do serve the crown, and then we might swap over maybe to an intrigue. Could be quite fun. Let, we'll go in an intrigue lifestyle, why not? Oh yeah, and if you want the mod list as well, I'll uh, chuck it in the description so you can easily see what mods I'm playing. None of them are, like game-changing, just graphical. Like, I love this mod. I cannot remember the name of it now. Just makes all the icons look a bit nicer and stuff like that. That's all the mods I really got on do. 117 for this claim. It's really expensive. I don't know why they're so expensive. So yeah, once again, we've got to get out of debt, and we should absolutely obliterate this guy. It took so long, our truce ended. That's how long it took. So we might as well get him started on the next one as well. Maybe down here then. This guy, he's quite weak. So let's start a claim down here as well, while we get this war done. Okay, we did have the son. Okay, so we do now have a male primary heir. So we can make sure to marry him off, non-matrilineally. Possessed. Um, I mean... It's a pretty good alliance, but, uh, you know, I don't want to, you know, send my son off to some possessed woman, to be honest. There's no good alliances around, so we'll leave it. Because this person wants more power. She thinks my family have way too much power. I mean, yeah, it's not my fault you weren't born into this family, you know? The good old-fashioned, you know, class system, you know? You just weren't born into it. You're screwed. Right, let's go for this guy then. 
Let's get him. Yeah, let's siege this. If we if they don't stop us, it'll just end again. Okay, so we got a new leader. This guy died of his internal injuries. Um, of course, we're going to carry the war on. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I thought he... Un what came? Like, well, that was a bit of a curveball, wasn't it? Can we get away? Come on, let's get in the mountains. Come on, let's run, 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 run. Are they chasing me? Like, no, no, no. Where are they going? Come on, if we can get the war target, that's insane. Please. We're only up to 5%. Why are we up so low? Oh, this siege in our... Oh, this is just tragic. So they're siege in our capital. Let's go for theirs as well. I don't know. Yeah, we're not going to be able to fight them, probably. White piece? No, I mean, we're, we're in this war now. We're winning. Tables have turned. Come on, please, 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 please. We're up 47%. Right, what is the plan of action? There's a lot of them. Yeah, they're coming up. So we're going to have to just hold this. Oh, God. Ooh. Okay, they're moving there on their own. Let's get them. Let's chase these. We can defeat this one army. Split them up. Or maybe this guy down here. Yeah, let's go for these. As long as my allies follow me, we got this. They've split up. So that was their biggest mistake. Should we? Yes, come on. Oh, God. This is so stressed. Okay, we caught them. Now we need our allies to hurry up or we'll lose. Oh, my God. That's literally prob... That is actually tragic. Un I cannot believe that. Really, game? <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, for... F do we just... Do we just white piece this war? Oh, let's just white piece it. Okay, fair enough. We somehow lost that, and now we're, like, so stressed. Comfort eater, let's see. Minus one stewardship, but we get more stress lost. We get more prestige this way, but we lose money. Uh, we'll become a comfort eater. Oh, okay. So, through all of that fighting... Oh. I didn't... You probably noticed this, and you're like, did you not notice? But no, I didn't notice. That is split in two, so that's why this guy was fighting. That, okay. That makes a bit more sense. Oh, did you just see that? Whoa, whoa, I, I just got ripped off. I was like, oh yeah, I love this guy back. They, they tortured him. 50, it costs 50 gold to indulge in food. How much is she eating? So yeah, I just went ahead and found an inflation calculator. We'll do 50, I know it's not pounds, but you know, what? We'll, the earliest I can go... Is 12.09. Let's see. Excuse me? Bloody hell. Is eating that much food? You fucking pig. So yeah, we just found out my character literally means indulge in food. Like, a whole nation's worth of food. You know what? Without a debt, let's do it straight away. I don't know what kind of troops we're with after that. Oh. Okay, we got a peasant uprising as well. We'll focus on that second. Where are, even are they? Um, okay, all the way down there. So let's focus. We'll win this one, hopefully. Oh, shit. So my lead just declared war to actually unite the whole land again. And it's pretty close. You may actually be able to do it. Ooh, okay, my, hu oh, my husband died and I'm like super stressed again. You know what? Let's have some fun. Let's marry a lunatic. Come on, come join. As long as he doesn't like try murder me. I'm sure we'll get along. Oh my god, my son now has pneumonia. Oh, mate, we, we can't afford it. You're, you're left out for it this time. You're just gonna suffer. Oh, yes. That guy died. Yes. Hated that guy. So actually, let's make this guy a court physician. We need 10 gold. Okay, sorry, son. Like, yeah, you might die. Oh, I just checked. Three more days until the royal court comes out as well. I'm so excited for that. And if you didn't see as well, they said that um, you got to wrap up your games and that. Because, yeah, it's not going to be compatible. Because obviously, there's like a free update that comes out with them as well. So that is going to be a lot of fun. I can't actually wait for that. Uh, you. Who are you? You are calling me to a war against them. I mean, I have to accept, really, but I don't want to. So, yeah, we'll have to accept, and hopefully they don't come back down here to attack me. They just go to north, where's capitalism, maybe fight that guy instead. You know what? I'm going to change. Let's get in a learning focus, and let's tr try and survive. Right, and let's go for it. Our claims, declare war, and, yeah, raise all straight on this point. Let's get straight in there. This should be fine. Okay, nice. Let's end that before anything else happens. And... I mean, really, unless they do win this, which is looking likely, to be fair. Oh, this is another vassal. Okay, great. Let's get this guy's land then. And this guy is so good, I trust him to hopefully get a full duchy claim. Does it say the likelihood? No, it, it's possible side effect, but it doesn't say the percent. But I imagine it's quite good with this guy. All right, it is unmarried, so maybe a strong alliance would come in. Ha Ooh, that's a massive alliance. So yeah, let's do that. That's insane. Ooh, before I forget, and while I have some money... Wait, why can't I make this guy my court physician? Oh, I have no idea why I can't do that. That's weird. 
can make him it. Uh, he's got decent ish learning. Why not? Who doesn't want a lunatic court physician? Exactly. Offer you cannot refuse. Okay, so it's just the one claim. But you know what? Let's go for it. And we'll get this guy. We'll make him a claim up here as well. Because, yeah, it's not connected now. Raise all and straight march. We just want to stop him basically joining his allies. If he runs away, that's fine as well, though. So our liege basically wants us to capture someone. I mean, I'll give it a go. 75 gold. And we got him. Easy money. I mean, yeah. That was a free, like, what? 150 gold for doing absolutely nothing? Ooh, okay. Finally, we can get athletic or journal. and go athletic. I always find that the best. So useful for losing stress. I don't know where... Okay, he's sieging down there. Let's siege all this guy's land first, then. Oh, we, we did get a claim on all of it. Great. Obviously, it happened just after he declared this war. What are the odds on murdering? Not very great, actually. That's quite terrible. White Peace. Okay, so I just had a look online, and I've seen people say about CK2 that if you end in a White Peace, it doesn't give you a truce. Maybe that's not true. Okay, so let me disband. That means we don't have a truce, right? Oh, game. Like, right, at least I'll remember that for the future. I got his wife in my prison, though. For a favor, you won't even pay for it, you tight little sh I mean, I'm not letting her go then, and let's actually... No, I'm not going to torture it. That might be a bit harsh. So it's going to end in a truce. So we'll lose some fame and people will dislike us. But we're getting on a bit. We're 53. Let's go for it. I mean, we don't exactly need the fame. So, raise all. I'm going to get the whole count, uh, the whole duchy this time. And yeah, let's actually go for his capital then. Siege all around here and we should win. No problem whatsoever. Nice. Right. Okay, great. Okay, that worked out fine. Let's end it. We're going to start an independence faction. At least this way, you may just accept that let's go into war with him. Oh, you know what? It's camel time. You know it. I know it. Let's go. Okay, we got one. That wasn't as exciting as I thought. Let's see. How's this faction looking like? Yeah, we're 300 odd percent. So let's press demands. Then war it. You actually thought that? Like, really? Come on, mate. Let's just get his capital. Let's just get in there. We don't want to fight you, so don't come fight us. Why is this taking so long? Oh, these taking so long. They're already going to be halfway up my land. Oh my god, they're actually taking years to... Oh, why did that end? So, captured air. Nice. I just made loads of alliances as well, quickly as well then. Just to try and bring them all in. As you can see, we got almost 5k alliance power now as well. But, that's not bad for this life. You know, from a randomly generated character, we've become independent. Okay, so we need how, what level of fame? A lot more fame, and then we can go for a kingdom war. If we can get this in her life, that would be absolutely amazing. You know what, while we wait, let's try and get the land we tried getting earlier, but we were way too weak and we just got destroyed. Hopefully we can actually get that now. Okay, let's just raise our army, go straight for the war target. Let's see how it goes. Another husband died, and now they want... Oh my god, stop. Okay, I'm not too stressed out, thankfully. Let's try and get this war. I don't know how many troops do they have. Less. So we might not even need to call our allies in, which would be, would be better, of course. Okay, let's go for his cap. But oh, a new opponent. Yeah, my goal's the same this time. It seems okay. Even weaker. So that works for me. See, if we can capture someone important, that's really going to be helpful. No. Going to get in and fight this guy's army. Should give us a decent chunk of war scores. I don't think we fought yet. No. So this should be big. I might even end it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. After all that time, we finally got, what is it called? Dra. 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 Dra sounds cooler. I'm going to go with Dra. Okay, so one more level of prestige left. We are 67, but I'm not too worried. We do have a plus five years life expectancy. We just need to get rid of obese. We can make some titles for some extra prestige. That might be really helpful. Oh, the f- Ah, ah. Amira Dazin of the Forzid Emirate has passed on to the eternity at age 69. She died of old age, an old woman. She lived a long and fulfilling life. That she did. I'll say that much. So yeah, she came from that. I mean, to have it all that and obviously all the bits in the middle down to here. That's really good to be honest. We weren't far away from getting all of this guy's land as well. But either way, that was still a massive success. Now, the original idea for this video was to actually have a wheel decide every like decision as well that pops up. But that would be so painful. So if we have any other ideas, please let me know in the comments. And of course, if you want to see more of this, leave a like. It really helps. But yeah, I am sure I will make more, but probably after the Royal Court does release. 
But yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. But yeah, of course, I'm going to end the video with a massive thank you to all the channel members. We have Bayek Von Quark, Arcane, Damien, Intimia1, Irrelevant, Luke Jarrett, Zigadelic, Random Icelander, and Dover404. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and hopefully, I'll see you in the next one.